Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and you're watching Train Simulator 2019 uh, where I am taking, uh, taking to the Gothard line on a brand new route uh, from the nice people at Rivet Games uh, who were good enough to send me a code. I don't, I don't know what they were expecting, but uh, this is what they're going to get. Uh, today we are driving the, and I've written this on a post-it note, the SBB EWIV, could be four, don't know, BT uh, driving coach. Which is this, uh, this this thing here. Uh, it was a train, obviously. Uh, now, obviously, the, the grunty bits down that end, I think. And uh, uh, given the fact that there's a dude sat here, hello. Uh, that's that's who we're going to be. Uh, that's who we're going to be occupying. Now we are quite currently in Geshinnen. Yeah, I know. There's a place we've not been in a while. Uh, and uh, and given the amount of time I spent it on the Gothard line or the Gothard region, let's say uh, in uh, in transport fever, uh, then this should uh, this should all be good. Right, we're about ready to go. So uh, why don't you stick around? Now, apparently, this uh, this particular service is rated as four out of five stars difficulty. Uh, which should make for quite the adventure. There's a lot of things going on here. That's the reverser. Let's bang that into forwards. No, master key. You look like a master key. Do you master key? Do you? No, apparently not. Reverse. Well, okay, let's... No, hold on, no. Spink, spank that into forwards. It was already in the right place. Okay. The electrical buttons say good. Do I need to raise the pantograph or is it already raised? Let's have a look. Uh, give me the other end of the train, please. Nope, we're good. Right. All right. Okay. That's that's in business. Uh, what else have we got going on here? Uh, it's a first. The first question is, which buttons do stuff? Uh, oh, that one does. What is it? Handbrake off. Yes. Okay. I'm going to assume that worked. Uh, and then uh, I don't know. Grip it and rip it. I suppose. Uh, there's the uh, here's the gripper. Where where are you, gripper? I, I can, uh, ah, there you go, right, and off, oh, that's the brake, oh, okay, doesn't tell me which, which, how much brake I've got on there, that's the loco brake, oh, crumbs, and this is going to be the e-brake and regulator, I've given that 65%, uh-huh, yeah, hmm, uh <laughs> okay, good, the V-controller, oh, yeah, more V, Please. I wonder if that's cruise control. I only wonder because I'm, I'm perplexed as to whatever else it could be. Flipping it, there's a lot going on here. Uh, turn the, get rid of that. No, that's the. All oh, right, okay. Brakes forwards. Zero brake. Yes. And then you. Oh, we're moving. Okay. Well, whatever I've done, I've done it. Let's uh, let's enjoy the ride. Good. I figured that out pretty quickly. It's just a case of, of wiggling handles until you've wiggled them all and then something happens, as you well know. Anyway, leaving Geshenan, uh, and uh, and that's all that's all going good. Uh, crikey, it's got lots of pickup. I do like German trains, you know. They've they have they've got plenty of good. Uh, hold on, what's, what am I doing here? That's uh, whoa, no, whoa, whoa, combined brake. Oh, uh, okay. And then this this is more brakes for when you need more brakes. Roger that. Okay, now we're going to struggle to keep this on the speed limit, I imagine, which is why it's rated as being slightly difficult. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's for once see if we can't uh, if we can't do this properly. I'm not going to speed. Uh, our ETA is 25 minutes from now. Uh, we were a smidge late in departing. I mean, we loaded up on time, but we were a smidge late in departing. Uh, so, uh, so I don't think we're going to be exactly on time, but I can at least get us a, uh, a good smooth surface, surface, service. Yeah. All right. Uh, in the meantime, I've got the brake held exactly where it needs to be to keep us on the straight and narrow, which is good. Uh, probably going to have to keep an eye on signaling. Uh, I would imagine that's why this is, uh, this is rated as being quite challenging. Uh, should we do some uh, glamour shots? Oh, why not? Oh, you don't get much more glamorous than that, do you? Nine. You don't. There you go. Enjoy the scenery as it as it flits past. 
Um, it is a beautiful spring evening, according to the description for this one, but uh, I'll be honest with you, it's, it's not that beautiful in here. Uh, what have we got? Amplitude fluctuations going on. Just because that's how it is, I suppose. Um, oh, it's dark in here. Can we... Well, okay, there's, there's lots of sea in there. P potentially should have some lights on. Uh, I know you guys really dig my uh, videos in the dark the most. Green lights, yellow lights. Yeah, what? Okay, that's some kind of... Yeah, what? Yes. It's speak... We're now in pitch black. Uh, we're entering Hades. Um, either that or we're on the looper. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Those of you who know what that is, know what that is. Uh, incidentally, I, I may make many... Re I haven't even got the cab lights turned on. Only that which is already illuminated can I see. Well, I'm, I'm hoping that there'll be something uh, something emerging from this tunnel shortly. Um, I, could, I could just make out that I'm doing some more diving for treasure, couldn't I? What's that noise? Sounds sounds quite exciting. Uh, evidently, because we're going around the corner, something has occurred. Oh, there's the exit to the tunnel. Let's put on a... Uh, what? Uh, put, no, that's five again. Five doesn't doesn't do. That's I mean that's good, but it's not really no. Uh, three. Uh, three apparently does the same thing as one. Okay. Oh 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 ah oh, 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 back end of the train. Jolly good show. Right. Okay. Smashing. Uh, oh here we go. This could be an action shot. We we all love an action shot. And. Boom shakalaka! There it is! Uh, cruising along there in the SBB EWIVBT driving coach. Uh, what do you mean emergency brake? Oh, I missed a flipping AWS because I was outside looking at trains. Oh, no. All right, Rudy, how's it going? Yeah, lovely day for it. He's obviously driving the service in the opposite direction. We've got to go through the restart process because I've triggered a flipping emergency brake. Don't stop in the tunnel. I won't be able to see anything. Uh, uh, Alright, yeah. Bang that on. Go on. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, bring us to a complete stop. Let's, uh, let's put the V controller on to... Oh, hold on. That seems to be... Release. Release. Oh, let's, let's stick it around there. That seems to be good. Right. Can we just grip it and rip it again? Can we... Yeah, there we go. Right, full grunt. Let's be having you. Now, full grunt's going to get away from me quite quickly. Oh, it's so unreasonable that uh, just because I wanted to go check out the view that I get penalised by uh, by ignoring the what passes in Germany for AWS. Uh, the advanced warning service. The automatic, automatic, I bet it's automatic warning service. Uh, yes, almost, almost certainly to be the case. C certain, not certainly. Come on, get your get your diction right. Right, what's going on there? That's off. That's off. We're, we're on max grunt here. We should be picking up speed quite a lot faster than this, given that we're going downhill. Uh, we certainly maybe on wheel spinning like a bandit. Let's uh, let's do let's give it like twenty percent instead and see if that has an impact. Maybe I've still got a brake on. Maybe I'm being hindered by my what by my V controller. That's certainly certainly possible. If we uh, if we crank that up, oh the V's are really flowing now. It's dark again. Uh, yeah, I actually having built a line on this route, uh, being dark again is something I should expect. Perhaps it would behoove me to uh, to rummage around pressing buttons randomly to try and uh, ascertain the location of of some cab lights. Actually. I don't even need to don't even need to ask the question. They're in here somewhere. What's that? Am I going a bit quick yet? Headlights off. On. I want on on head. Oh, ruddy Nora. Okay, right. Well, I'm in the cockpit of my uh, of my battle station starship. What are we doing here? Max speed. Yeah, I know I'm speeding. We're going to try and ease it back a bit. Okay, 25% brake should do the trick. What have we got coming up here? We got some signals. Well, I don't know what colour they are, but we might end up running through them while I'm trying to figure out what the heck's going on in the dark. There we go. Coming out of the dark. Ready? Everybody? Oh, no. Okay. I was expecting a view. There wasn't one. 
Yeah, have another little time. It's nice, this. It's nice, good. I right, approve. Right, there we go. Down here you've got some sort of town, I would imagine. No, uh, it seems, seems to be quite plausible. Uh, now then, let's uh, let's get that down to about 20-ish 20, 20 percent. How's 10 doing? Uh, 15. Keep going. Do you want to look at the signal? Nah. What? Hush. And keep a bit more. 40 percent. 40 percent. Too much, that is. 35 percent would be the sweet spot then. More or less. Okay, cool. Well, as long as the grade stays... Oh, it's not. The grade's going to ease off, look. Okay. Oh, actually, we might we might make it on time. Now, currently, we're supposed to arrive at uh, 1737. We're currently sh slated to arrive at 1732. So, whatever I have done, I haven't hosed it yet. Obviously, give it time. I've got to find that flipping cab lights. Where are we? Uh, so... We, we're, we're using the uh, the science of headlights full. Ah, headlights low. Yes, give me that. Tail lights. Yeah, we'll have no headlights. Fine. Don't worry about the tail lights. Anyone coming up behind us should get caught by uh, by something else. Cabin lights. Turn them on. Thank you. Right. Now I can. What? Uh, now I can. Uh, I can simply enjoy the show. Hold on. We've slowed down too much. All right. Unslow down. There you go. Turn the brake off. I mean, basically, this is this is a controlled roll downhill uh, that we're experiencing here. Right, let's enjoy the tunnel with the lights on. I'll be honest, I was hoping for a little more than that. Let's put them on to max. Yeah, ah, oh, well, great, great shot of the pantograph kind of connecting metal there, going overhead. That's that's all jolly good. Uh, what sort of speed are we doing? We're starting to get a little bit swift. So let's ease that back down to 35%. Yeah. Yeah, I'm with you. I've got it. Don't you panic. I've got a hooter, and I'm hooting it. There you go. 79.5 on your kilometre scale there out of 80. This is all good. Uh, anyway, we're coming up on the Pfaffensprung line. Lean. Uh, 225. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that surprised you, didn't it? That was almost that was almost close. Uh, red light, green light. That's an emergency brake. Ah, I wonder if the red light was then for me. I'm going to go with yes, it was, because we're braking on an emergency basis again. Good times. Uh, this is what we like to see. Nothing. There ain't no party like an emergency brake party. And an emergency brake party most definitely stops. All right, crank all of that on. Yeah, hit the... What's the blue button do? I know, it looks good though, doesn't it? Zub maneuver. Oh, yes. I'm definitely going to try a submarine maneuver. Um, yeah, let's do that now. Zub maneuver, please. All right, no maneuvering at all at the moment because we've stopped. Right, rip it again. There you go. Yep, sorry about that. No. No, sorry about that. Not for you. What's that then? That was telling me something, and it's not telling me it anymore. Handbrake off. Turn the handbrake off. We don't want it. We are not currently under power. We are currently rolling. Interesting. Yeah, I'm not... Uh, I haven't got any impact. Or have I? No, I think I might have been rolling for that last section as well, you know, which would explain why our acceleration was um, uh, poor. It, yes. Given that this is all straight downhill, <laughs> I suspect I've not done a proper reset after both emergency brake triggers have gone on. In which case, I'm saving the company a hell of a lot of money. If we're not having to use any electricity at this point, then, uh, then it's all good. And the brakes still work, so who's really uh, who's really complaining? The needle's in the green. That one's got some in it, whatever. And uh, we're we're clearly doing some doing some speed. What have we got here? We've got the uh, Hauptleitung, Halt, Halp, Halp, Hauptleitung, Hauptleitung. Like I can't say it without tripping over it. I know how it's supposed to sound, but I can't make it sound like that. What have we got? Yellow lights. Okay, well they're fine. Yeah, they're not going to bother us. 
the reverser doesn't actually do much. No, it does. You flick it and it puts you in... Yeah, 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 yeah. Got it. Right. Don't bust me there, chief. I know what I'm doing. Right. Give this uh, a, bit of, a bit of 35. Maybe 30. Yeah, I know we're just over the limit. Well, if you didn't keep stopping me, I wouldn't have to be quite as aggressive. Oh, I think we are picking up a little bit of momentum here as the uh, as the gradient becomes steeper, although it does level off at the bottom. Uh, now, I, I, I chose to drive this route because uh, I wanted to look at the view, and I'll be honest with you, so far, not really looking at the view. That said, once you've seen the view, you kind of go, mountains, beautiful, love it, absolutely, show me the mountains. Oh, I love a mountain. There you kind of go, right, good. Back to staring at this handle aimlessly. And there, 35 feels good. No, it doesn't. Less, 30. Yeah, thank you. Good. Glad to have you on my side there, beeping, warning, something or other. Uh, you're the real hero of this uh, of this adventure. I've got a speedo here, all right, that's telling me the speed, obviously. Uh, i got another one here that's telling me the speed, and that's before you get to the uh, the HUD. Uh, that is unrealistic that it's telling me the speed as well. It's almost like this particular control area wants me to know how fast I'm going. It seems jolly keen to uh, to let me know that. Now, let's let's turn our attention to these two gauges here. Uh, kilovolts, I'm, I'm pretty much in tune with. Yep, good, thank you. Oh, we got some signals coming up. Should we see if they're legit before I continue my... Uh, uh, my repartee on the subject of kilovolts. What I was going to say is, look, that one is uh, is showing we've got 12 kilovolts, which is probably plenty. Uh, and then, uh, and then over here, that's that's hovering around the less than zero mark. I have no idea. Uh, the Gert Nellen line is coming up for uh, for Gothard line line spotters, um, and uh, and that should be good. So far, I haven't seen a Dakota flying overhead. So that's a red light. Now, if this trips the emergency brake again, which it does, right, okay, I understand that now. That signal means I should be stopping. It's fine. We're still at, I've actually saved even more time uh, than previously. Just crank the emergency brake all the way on. We'll come to a stop, and then I'll just take the brakes off, and, uh, and we'll gradually roll up to speed again until I can figure out how to use the actual loco. What are you? Handbrake off. Off, 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 off. Handbrake on. Uh, yeah, put the handbrake on as well. Let's get this over and done with. Good. That's the handbrake sign. No, it's not. Uh, maybe that's the insufficient brake pressure line signal indicator? Could be. Don't know. Turn that off. Yeah, you see, it does feel like we're getting a little bit of traction here just not very much I mean we're not picking up speed very fast at all so I think there is a reset process that I should have done but haven't what are you you're the sander well let's let's give it a bit and see if it gives us any extra uh, you know go no what are you wipers don't need those uh, what else have we got here that could possibly be interfering with my uh, my smooth progress that I'm clearly making? Uh, cabin lights. Yeah, we've done that. I mean, admittedly, it's very atmospheric, uh, but uh, but I prefer to be able to see at least something. And I, I imagine you rather do as well. What am I missing in terms of a restart sequence? Because we're, we're definitely not under power. This is just gravity. Uh, that is working for us. What about a V controller? What if I tell the V controller to go and sit down here for a bit? Is that has that changed? Anything? Oh, it's slowing us down. Look, right, the V controller. I think my uh, my guess that the V controller is in fact some kind of uh, speed regulating system might actually be on the money. And I wonder whether the purple dot there. Well, let's uh, let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. It's cruise control, look. And the V handle is uh, is affecting my current cruise control limit. So if I set that for 80, like so. Ooh, yeah, 62. No, we want more than that. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. 65, no. Keep going. 66, no. 67, no. 
Oh, I see. No, that's the speed, you nana. Look at the pink dot. You've already that's identified what you wanted to do. There you go. Bang that in there, and we won't go any faster. Probably. Um, it seemed to slow us down previously, so uh, so there's that. Oh, uh, this needle's now up to zero uh, percent. Grand. Oh no, no, now less. Oh, that's going to be my. Uh, that's going to be the auto. Uh, the, the the cruise control kicking in. Look. So uh, I suspect that's over here on the uh, the Zug Brainscraft, uh, or it's not the uh, Far Light Tung's uh, Spanung. It's not that. Uh, anyway, I should probably pay attention. Right, we've got another signal coming up in 0.7 of a mile. I should try and be ready for that, I reckon. Or we're just going to trip the flipping brake again. Um, really? Are you going to gamble on... Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, let's let's gamble on having to stop at this one. 75%. Looks green. It looks green. All right. Crank it back up again one time there, Tommy. And, yeah, see? That's green. That one's red. It's making this concrete number uh, just hang out there and go, okay, we'll wait for the stupid passengers to go through. Thank you. The stupid passengers are grateful. And... Uh, we're moving onwards into another tunnel as we continue our way down the mountain. And uh, anytime soon, we're going to hit the ski jump and it'll be brilliant. Right, we've got another signal coming up in a mile. No clear indication from it at this time what it wants me to do. So I'm going to once again bus, uh, van. Yes, good. I should probably say yellow bus, no returns, and then punch someone in the arm if I was playing this properly. Yeah, I know. You die. You people who do this zip dog business. No, 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 no. It's all about yellow car. And the idea is say yellow car, no returns. If you don't say no returns, the next person can just say yellow car as well. And then you punch him in the arm. Um, and that's if you spot a yellow car. Pretty sure buses qualify as well. I wasn't really paying attention. Haven't slowed down at all, but that's okay. Because, no, that's that's a tree. It's not the, uh, that's not the light. That's the light, look. And we're fine. This red light, that's for someone else. It's not for me. I was right. It wasn't for me. Uh, well, it, it, it's going well. I'll tell you what, the auto control here is uh, is doing a great deal of the heavy lifting in terms of my uh, my not hosing this. The red light of, of warning danger is still on, though. There must be a reset button somewhere. What's, the, uh, what's this pedal all about? I'm alive! The Vigilance Pedal. Okay, summons Batman. Alright, good. Well, we're, we're about seven minutes out from our destination. And, uh, and I, for one, am uh, I'm very much looking forward to, uh, to reaching the destination in one piece, which apparently I'm doing. I mean, I've only, I've only tripped, the, uh, tripped the old emergency brake twice. I mean, that's, that's going well so far. We've got another brake in a... In a it's not a mile, it's a kilometre. As we go onto the Inchy Line... And, uh, you know, it's, there's your alpine cottages doing exactly what you would expect them to do. Nothing. Just sitting there. Having a lovely time at all. Uh, so far, my score is 900, minus 766, which, personally, I think is is quite respectable, given what a hash of this I've made, given that it's a walk in the park. Uh, where are we? Where's... There must be a button somewhere that says, oh, hold on, what are you? Doesn't really matter what you are. Uh, what about you? Oh, hold on, there was... Go on. Emergency brake. Well, I don't think that's going to disable it, is it? I, don't, I, I would imagine that that just, that just trips it on. Not that we need it at the moment, because everything is peachy keen right now. Uh, every, you know, we're, we're, we're getting this done without any real due care and attention. Uh, at all, although I can guarantee if I go for a glamour shot, and I'm going there we go um, that uh, that something will occur so I'm keeping half an eye on this flipping bandit here because uh, it likes to turn up and spoil my day basically uh, right, kilometres to go and, uh, and then we've got another set of signals now my spider sense says these ones are going to be red so uh, I'm going to ease down to 70% uh, to, to braking here, just in case I'm right. 
I mean, admittedly, we're not exactly slowing down very quickly here, but I will thump absolutely every brake I've got uh, at my disposal, should the need arise. Yeah, well, see, we're gently slowing down. Can you see the signal? No. There's another corner. Okay. If I'm right about this, you're all going to be like, man, this guy's good. It's not. It's green. All right. Okay. Ramp it up. Let's go. Yeah. No, it was just instinct on my part that said that the next one would be green. Although, aren't they supposed to give you like a yellow signal before a red? They are. A yellow means that the next signal could be red or yellow or something in between. Orange. Oh, we're going over a bridge. And I can't see anything because these windows are uh, inferior. What do we got? How much, how much bridge do we have there? I won't like quite a bit of bridge. All right, put me back in the driving seat. Right, we're coming up on the Amsteg Seilenen Line uh, Zweien Fierzig. Uh, and uh, Lenin, uh, Sil Silanen, Silane, Sil Sil Silanen, I'm going to go with. I reckon that's close. Possibly with a cigar, possibly with not. Uh, right, what are you? Instrument dimmer. Oh, yeah, go on, him. Dimmer. Uh, okay, all right, yeah, that does a bit of that. Right, well, we don't want a bit of that. Leave it alone. Okay, another kilometre. We've got another set of signals. And every new set of signals is increasingly exciting. What up? Where are we? They put it back in the cab. Uh, we're done with that now. Anyway, these are saying green, green. Now, I I, I'm going to postulate that the double green there indicates that the next one's green as well. In which case, you know, giving it the beans is, uh, is not a bad thing. Anyway, we've got six kilometres left on this most epic of roll downhill uh, rolls downhill and uh, I feel good about everything frankly uh, we're uh, we're slated to come in three and a bit minutes early so uh, you know unless I make a pig's ear or something real soon there you go it's this one green 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 just like it's, there's like six clear signals ahead of me I feel very happy to be alive let me tell you. Oh, this looks uh, this, uh, looks Gothardish. No, uh, the fly past shots doing me no favours here. Turn, uh, flip it around that way. Let's uh, let's try and get some kind of a view. There's a there's a truck. It's not yellow. There's uh, there's no arm punching required in that regard. Let me tell you. Uh, coming around the uh, the corner. Yeah, that's that's super duper. There you go. Hey, ooh, nice bit of nice bit of carriage articulation going on there. That's good. Yeah, I very much approve of such things. And uh, where are we at the moment? We're just passing somewhere. Uh, I might be able to. Yellow car, no returns. Thwap. Oh, what? No, you're in Germany. Well, you're not. You're in Switzerland or Austria or Italy. Um, you're in one of them. Take a guess. All right, well, given that German covers me for, for Germany, Switzerland, kinder, and uh, and Austria, we shall go with a yellow car. Uh, it's, uh, no, Jaune is French. What the heck is yellow in German? I can't remember. Uh, let's see if, uh, see if Madame, uh, Madame Zanzibar has got her ears on. Uh, hold on, what's yellow in German? Gelb. You'd say what? No, you wouldn't. Gelb. No, you'd say gelb, because that's how it's spelled. Uh, right, it is a gelb alto. Kinda returns. Thwap. There we go. That's got that out of the way. That was a long way to go for a quite a weak joke. But, uh, hey, if you came for strong jokes, you are in the wrong place, my friend. Uh, right, three kilometres to go. Uh, ETA is still positive, just under three minutes ahead of schedule is what we are. Uh, we've got another signal coming up and then it flattens out a bit and that's the point at which we will find out whether I have been running this train freewheel down the hill. I'm going to go with yes you have or it's just kind of gone, he's just ignoring us. Integra acknowledge. Okay. Yup. I acknowledge you Integra. Uh, I give you maximum respect. 
Okay, well, we'll find out once we're on the flat whether I am, in fact, just freewheeling down the hill or not. And the train's just kind of gone, oh, whatever. Go on, then. Yeah, no, see if I care. In which case, I should probably try and find the button that, uh, that allows you to be powered once more. And uh, it has to be said, once I figured out that, uh, that flinging a few Vs at the, uh, at the track there kept you largely under control. Oh, hold on. Yellow, green, green. That means something. Okay, right. Uh, crank the brake on. Yeah, oh, yeah, every time. Yeah, thank you. Oh, I wonder if the alert warning system is telling me you've got a signal coming up there, Buster, and uh, you should probably start to uh, start to take action in order to address it correctly. I'm not seeing a speed limit change, so we are allowed to just rattle into the station at 80, hammer on the handbrake, and hope that everything ends for the best. Uh, Look, I am c I'm committing to a slowing down manoeuvre here. What do you got for me, Signals? We've got green, green, double yellow. <gasps> that's, uh, that's pretty severe. But also, it's this, I mean, this wasn't necessarily a bad idea to slow down at this point anyway, given that we've got the station coming up. We're also not slowing down very quickly. I'm on it there. Uh, let's give it a bit more break. Yeah, all right, let's give it some train brake as well. Oh, train train brake gets the job done. Okay, right, smashing. You can uh, you can release again. Uh, we'll release you a bit. We do need some momentum in order to reach our destination here. Uh, we've got a, a kilometre and a smidge to go. Possibly ought to inform the passengers of my intentions at this point. Guten Tag, mein Damen und Herren, and those who are of other persuasions. Uh, shortly, we will be arriving into Erstfeld uh, Gleis Dry, uh, where I invite you to get often Z train. Uh, get often der train. Das train, D train. It's one of those Zug. Anyway, well, Zug is kind of locomotive. Um, a uh, train overall is, is something else, probably. Could could certainly be one of the... Anyway, um, uh, here is uh, Erstfeld uh, und uh, yeah. Raus, Raus. Sure, why not? Uh, yeah, I mean, that, that could work. Um. Schnell, schnell. Uh, often the train gets them, the... And so forth. Right, uh, Gnau. Uh, hey, well, well, what do you know? We are slowing down at an appropriate point here, you know. Uh, let's now uh, apply a little bit of train brake. Uh, we can probably stop anywhere you like. No, hold on. We've still got a bit of distance to go. 200 metres to go. Ah, we're near enough. You don't need to go to full, di yeah, go to full distance. Take that back off again. We're still doing 20 kilometres now. It's all good. Excuse me there, uh, mein Frau line, probably a Frau line. Um, Sie sind ein bisschen close to the edge of uh, yonder Gleis. One would not wish to uh, swipe and see avec uh, mon train. Oh, crumbs, I'm all over the joint. Uh, right, bang that on. Yeah, give it, give it the beans there. Uh, crank that down to everything other than emergency. No, no, not emergency. Don't need emergency. That'll do. We appear to have arrived. Uh, T is for doors. Oh, I've done it. I pressed the T button. It's doing the thing. Right, let's get a glamour shot here. That's the wrong end. Well, you're not going to do any kind of flyby at the moment, are you? Because you're not moving. Let's, let's, uh, let's go here and then wander around uh, for ourselves. We've got the doors open. That's good. Uh, apparently we'll allow bicycles on here which is just a bad policy I'm, I won't be I won't lie to you I mean if you're going to cram this full of commuters which clearly you are uh, you don't want flipping bikes in the way even though people who have folding bikes smugly using up standing space in the uh, in the carriage area or stuffing it in a luggage rack using one entire row to themselves I don't care if it is a Brompton you're a git uh, and uh, you know Learn to walk or use public transport. Take your bicycle and put it back in the shed where it belongs. You're a grown-up, damn it. Use mechanised transportation while we still have it. Before the world collapses and we're all on bicycles all the time. That's my policy. I'm sticking with it. 
Ah, there you go. Well done, driver. That was a successful journey. I should Coco. Uh, uh, minus 516 points. I ruddy nailed this one. Now, I'd quite like not to exit so that I can do my little talky-talky bit at the end while the train is still present. Do we think that's going to happen if I press this? Well, if we do, I can pretend like it's worked just fine and use kind of a screenshot or maybe some kind of repeated footage uh, of, uh, of what I was seeing previously. Hmm. Anyway, that's your lot. Next time, definitely America, probably Steam. Cool, could not, cool lads. Well, there's a train look, that's nice. It'd be good to look at it and not exit the game. Nah, I'm gonna exit. Oh, no, well, no, that's your lot. No, let's pretend I didn't. Cheerio! There you go, that's, uh, that's your train simulator 2019 on the Gothard line. Uh, one of my personal favorite routes there. Well, you say that, I haven't really got favorite routes other than the ones that I've, I've traveled on. Uh, but having spent so much time in that region doing your transport fever, uh, it was uh, it was quite nice to not look at it at all as I stared aimlessly at a black cockpit as we headed down the hill. And uh, I'm I'm pretty certain we were unpowered for most of that journey, or at least we weren't getting any tractive power happening. Uh, if you agree, comments to that that's that's what they're for is is for you to kind of go no you you just fluked that by rolling down the hill and occasionally applying the brake. Hey, what you going to do? I still completed it, didn't I? That makes a change, and it itself is a novelty. Anyway, the next time we visit Train Simulator, we'll be going to America, probably doing Steam. Probably. Probably doing Steam. Which is just its just a bad idea, people. I, mean, I don't know what... I mean, it's going to be 30 minutes of me not really pushing or pulling anything around, and just, you know, occasionally wafting a control in the, uh, in the cab. And, and see what happens. But I suppose, you know, you know that's what's going to happen. So you're, you're on board already.